wooden bird cage with a clipbook of a bird inside. When the brief was given, we, the whole gang of us actually thought that mechanical flipbook was the one that you have to use your hand and turn. So when we googled everything, we found out that it's more of the electric or electronic kind of flipbook where you plug in and then turn on and it will start moving or you push a button, it will start moving. This subject, right, it quite a lot of subjects add up together so you get to touch on the actual hands-on things and even the digital, the animation part, the coding part, crafting. We also get to learn quite a few new things like using the laser cutter, using the Arduino, connecting wires and soldering things. A lot of difficulties or challenges such as firstly was getting the material or thinking about what material to use like we have quite a few options like wood, acrylic or even thinner metals so in the end I chose wood or plywood because it's cheap you can cut it really fast and we have the laser cutter to use system right? I did a lot of trial and error like using Illustrator to create the outline of the lock itself first and then use that part to use the laser cutter to cut it out and keep testing is it really intact or is it still a bit loose if it's a bit loose then I had to readjust the measurements in Illustrator initially the wires weren't really that hidden because the birdcage the bottom part there's a uh, hole, hole, hole. So you can actually see through and look at all the wires, the Arduino, the motor, and some lights from there. So I decided that I should cover it up a bit because it looks messy from the outside. So I designed the cover, a little cover that looks like a bird's nest, and use the laser cutter to cut it again and place it around so it covers the entire wire down there. 